The Precision 358 one is the highest performing model in the Dell Precision 3000 series of laptop workstations. And while it seems almost identical to the Precision 3580 on the outside, the differences are primarily internal. The main differentiators being support for Intel's 45W H series CPUs, which while containing the same number of cores as the Precision 3480 and 3580, higher power limits allow performance to be sustained for longer periods without reducing the speed of the CPU. On the graphics card side, there are also more powerful options, with the RTX A1000 6GB or the latest generation RTX 2000 ADA to better support more complex datasets and other graphically intensive workloads such as SOLIDWORKS Visualize Rendering. At 358mm wide by 233 deep, it's almost the same size as the Precision 3580, however the 3581 adds a couple of millimetres to the thickness, and this is to accommodate the more powerful components, including the option of a larger 97 watt hour battery. It has a slightly higher starting weight of just under 1.8 kilograms, but despite this it still feels pretty light in the hand. Port-wise, we have two full USB A ports, along with a HDMI 3.5mm jack and a wired network Ethernet port plus SD card reader. On the other side, we have two USB-C ports, including one used to power the laptop, and optionally a smart card reader for security identification. So where does the 3581 fit in the range? Over the last three generations, the specifications have increased, taking it more towards the mid-range, and as we'll see in the performance tests, it is the optimal performer of the 3000 series. The Precision 3581 still packs plenty of power for 2D and 3D CAD workflows with low thousands of parts, plus the occasional use of simulation and visualization workflows.